Welcome to Synagogues of England, Part 6. In this episode, we look at three cities, Leicester, Lincolnshire, and Liverpool. We start out in Leicester. There are at least two Jewish houses of worship here. The first is the Leicester Hebrew Congregation. Etched in stone above the arch front portal is the Torah verse, Ma tovo alecha Yaakov mishkan osecha Yisrael. How goodly are thy tents, O Israel. Leicester is in the East Midland area, which is becoming more and more populated by those of the Muslim faith. In fact, there are a handful of mosques down the block from this old synagogue building. The synagogue has recently been awarded 1.7 million pounds for repairing the structure and the construction of a visitor center. Its rabbi is Shmuley Pink who joined them in August of 2001. The congregation publishes starting times for the daily shacharit or morning service, but only publishes a Mincha Marv afternoon-evening service for Fridays and Saturdays. The building shown here was constructed in 1897. The other synagogue is the Leicester Progressive Jewish Congregation, also known as Neve Shalom. The congregation started in the very late 1940s. It acquired the building shown here in 1995. However, the building itself was originally erected in 1885 and was used as a schoolhouse until it became a synagogue. Services are sporadic. Some months there may be a full slate of Friday evening and Saturday morning Shabbat services. Other months there may only be one service or possibly a weekend where there are two services. The congregation calls itself Neve Shalom as it also means Oasis of Peace as a way of projecting brotherhood between the longtime Jewish community and the more recent influx of Muslims in the area. Despite the fact that this is a non-Orthodox liberal congregation, it most recently hired a Mark L. Solomon to be its rabbi with an ordination of the Orthodox persuasion. Our next stop takes us to the city of Lincolnshire, which is in the east central part of England with a population of more than 750,000. And we're looking at a synagogue building here that may be the oldest still standing in England. It's called the Lincoln Synagogue, Lincolnshire Jewish Community. It also practices a liberal brand of Judaism. Originally, we thought that the building shown here with the spikes embedded into the, the paved road to be the synagogue building. We're not quite sure, but it still may possibly be so. The street that is on is called Steep Hill, which kind of makes sense, noting the incline to the road. It's listed as constructed in the 14th century. The cobblestone building to its left is called Jews Court. A bookstore is located there now, and the building was thought to have been constructed between 1150 and 1180. Before the Jews were expelled from England in 1290, the Lincoln area was considered one of the most important of the Jewish communities in England. The current synagogue building was established in 1992 and holds services for Shabbat on a regular basis on Friday evenings and Saturday mornings. The synagogue claims to have either a cantor or a rabbi leading the services but does not list the name. We won't come across the Beatles or Penny Lane but we're in the city of Liverpool, hometown to that famous musical group. It's also home to a handful of Jewish places of worship. The first one, as shown here, is the Allerton Synagogue, located in South Liverpool. By the way, Liverpool is in northwest England and has a population of more than 550,000 residents. The Allerton Synagogue is of the Orthodox persuasion. It offers a full slate of services on a daily basis. And here's a note of interest. On Saturday nights in the June-July time of the year, Shabbat can be over at around 10.45 to 11 o'clock at night. The congregation's spiritual leader is Rabbi Natan Fagelman. Here's another note of interest. The building is attached 
to a modern development of apartments, which is also administered by the Liverpool Jewish Housing Association. The congregation was started in the early 1950s. The building shown here was not erected until 1959. There's another Orthodox congregation, the Childwell Hebrew Congregation, which was founded in 1935, but the building was not made ready for regular use until 1938. Here's a brief look at the inside sanctuary. Here is the Liverpool Old Hebrew Congregation, also known as the Princess Road Synagogue. It's been there since 1874. Its spiritual leader is Rabbi Ariel Abel. Services are currently held only on Saturday morning Shabbat, as well as the major holidays. In May of 1979, the synagogue building was the victim of an arson, and there was quite extensive damage. Torah scrolls were destroyed and repairs were required to the internal decor. Here is a brief look at the main sanctuary area. Here is an overhead shot of the building that also houses the Liverpool Reform Synagogue. The congregation offers very little published information about its leadership or when services are held or the history of this congregation. So, we'll move along to the final synagogue on this tour. And this one also has very little information. It's called the Wilton Alternative Dominion. It's of the Lubavitch Chabad persuasion, and it's run by the person who probably lives here. His name is Rabbi Avrami Kivman. We've concluded this trip, but there are still many more synagogues in England to check out. Bye for now, and see you soon.